Okay guys, so here we have a table and what I've done is I've colored the table into two sections to represent two different types of data but they're in one table and sometimes what you want to do is you want to split the table so you want this data that is in this section here to be separate from this data which is in this section here. So we split our table and it's actually really really easy. I'm just going to go to the first row where I want the split to happen. I'm going to go to my layout tab, okay, because remember layout has to do how things are laid out on a screen. So I'm going to go to my layout tab and I'm going to click split table and watch what happens. Easy as that. Split the table and now I have two separate tables. Right, now what I have here is another table and I'm going to show you something that can happen often to people who are not familiar with working with tables in Microsoft Word and that is fitting it onto a page correctly because sometimes a table is just too big perhaps they've copied and pasted it from another source and here you can see while I'm looking at this table and it doesn't matter if I zoom in or zoom out it's going off the page and I'm going to be losing some information there so I need to fix this easiest way to do this is just to select the table or just be inside the table go to layout again choose auto fit and now we have three choices we can say auto fit the contents auto fit window or fixed column width well we're going to do auto fit window in other words fit the table to the page so watch what happens when i click auto fit window it then adjusts the table to fit onto the page. If I said auto fit contents, it's something that's a little bit different. I'm going to show you that now. Right, here I have a table. And as you can see, I have various sizes of columns here. And it's a little bit confusing because perhaps I copied and pasted this from an Excel worksheet or somebody sent this to me via an email and they didn't know what they were doing and I don't actually know what's what and I want to make this automatically fit the content correctly. So again, I'm inside my table. I go to Layout, Auto Fit and this time I'm going to choose Auto Fit Contents. So watch what happens when I click on Auto Fit Contents. It automatically adjusts the contents of the table to fit onto the page. And that's what AutoFit Contents does. That was not good. Watch this. Holy crap, where'd it go?